Frank, as, as you look back at the Holy Cross game, you know what did you see? And if there was one area that you, you feel the need, team needs to focus on for this week with Bucknell, what would it be? Well, the obvious uh, answer to that is, uh, you know, the interior line on both sides of the ball. It was the uh, first time in a long time that I saw us, uh, you know, get, uh, get kind of handled that way. There were a variety of issues, um, you know, some replacing injured players with injured players that probably weren't even planning on playing. But we make no excuses about that. It's part of the game. Uh, they simply came in and outplayed us. They executed a great game plan. They planned on controlling the football, which they did for 38 minutes, and uh, we lost at the kind of football that I believe in and, and want to win with, and that's running the ball, controlling, stopping the run, and uh, not turning the ball over, all those kind of things, and the, and the field position game. Uh, but whatever, we're, you know, you look at all those things, but it still comes down to practice. Soft practice and soft preparation ends up in soft play. Um, I think it's a mixture of things, you know, uh, from – from me to the receivers to the O-line, you know, it's just, it's a mixture of things. It's not one spot you can point at and say, you know, there's our problem. But um, I think the uh, some of the guys are struggling with a little bit of confidence because you see them out in practice and they make great plays and, and then you kind of wonder on Saturday, you know, where's that at? And it is frustrating uh, with us being on the sideline so much and that, that falls directly on our shoulders. We got to be able to convert those third downs, um, especially early. We got to come out, you know, with the mentality of jumping on them early opposed to fighting back. And, and like I said, convert those third downs to keep our defense off the field and keep us on the field and scoring points. Yeah, you know, I know Joe Susan for years. He likes the same kind of football I used to like, you know, power, toss, counter. You know, punching in the face. He's using as many as four tight ends, for goodness sake. So um, they're good, quick. They have natural, good natural instincts, not quite as the super quick, as I call it, with uh, the Edmonds kid. But, you know, powerful, hard-nosed running backs uh, going to finish runs forward. Bucknell, they always, have a, they always have a good team. They always come to play just like any other, any other uh, team in our league. I mean, I feel like they always come out with some fire. They always come out with blitzes, uh, putting pressure. And uh, I think we just need to go out and uh, execute our job, and we can get it done on Saturday. This league, what I see, other than the obvious of Fordham being that much different, I don't think anybody else that much different from each other. And anybody can beat anybody else. And we're going up there, and we're going to see Bucknell, an undefeated team in the league. And we want to make a statement, and we're mad.